Welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, and welcome to my tutorial, Learning Major Key Signatures, the dice trick. Now, the only difference between one major key and another is the number of sharps or flats that it contains. In this lesson, we will learn to use one of a pair of dice to know how many sharps or flats are in a key. First, let's learn how the dice works. What number is on the bottom of this dice? The number is four. Now what number is under the bottom? The number is five. Let's roll it again. Now what number is under the die? The number is three. How am I able to tell you what number is on the bottom of the dice every time? It's very simple. The number on the top and the number on the bottom always add up to seven. If there's four on the top, three will be on the bottom. If there's five on the top, two will be on the bottom. If there's three on top, four will be on the bottom. Now how does this relate to music or musical keys? That's simple too. There are seven notes in a major key. Here's how we're going to use this information. If we know the number of sharps in a given key, we can use the die to tell us how many flats are in a flat key of that same name. For instance, the key of A has three sharps. The key of A flat has four flats. The key of G has one sharp. The key of G flat has six flats. The key of E has four sharps. The key of E flat has three flats. Now this works 100% of the time. If you have a flat key like B flat which has two flats. B is going to have five sharps. You can't go wrong using the dice trick. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.